Uh, welcome again to Qtile. I wanted to add something to the article about Compton. So the topic is Compton and the tip is as follows. Super shift return. Go to Qtile, go to scripts, go to content.conf. That's the one that's going to work. And this is for all the virtual box users. Here we have a code in line 180. It says virtual synchronization match the refresh rate of the monitor. This breaks transparency in virtual box. Put a hashtag in front of this line, save it, restart, we log, uh, restart content. Then you have a uh, transparent, sorry, transparent um, terminal, for instance. So that's a great tip. The other tip I'd like to include, but unfortunately we don't see anything because everything is super okay. And that's the following thing. In auto start, we are for opening or running Compton, right? But we say, here's the Compton conf, so the configuration that we'd like to use. So if you having problems, issues, then you can actually, um, well, figure it out yourself, analyze it yourself. Remember, Article Linux, we want you to become self-reliant. Don't ask questions to others, figure it out yourself. So what you can do is copy paste this code, go to Ctrl Alt T and Ctrl Shift V it. So what you're doing is, well, launching Compton uh, this way. Now, if Compton is already running, you get, of course, this message. There is already a Compton running. So I'm gonna kill all Compton first, and then again, say run Compton. So if nothing happens, if there are no warnings, then everything is okay and it's just fine and you have now a content that's just working if you want to test it further and put it in the background that's just this little sign in the back and then it's this this application has been sent to the back end to the background so if there are errors in here then you have to start analyzing and googling okay what changed in Compton because Compton is really moving fast in about four or five months time we've seen releases from four till now 6.2-2 so yes it's moving along it's um, been developed by these guys and if you're wondering what guys these guys so that's our github where everything is coming from and if you say hey there are problems there will always be problems and that's why we have on github here this um, issue you can report and you see backend x render driver hardware requirements questions artifacts bugs it's followed up two days ago by Carlson, etc so here it is if you think you can improve content that's where you report it all right those were the two tips enjoy content